No goals here at, at Silverland today. What was your assessment of the performance? Uh, assessment of the performance is another good workout pre-season. Uh, a lot of players, 90 minutes. And, uh, you know, really obviously everything at this stage is uh, building for a week, week today. You know, so uh, pre-season is always, you know, about the fitness, about the game time. And then uh, next week, obviously, we just uh, put everything together on the build-up for Oxford. And mainly a fringe squad here today and some of the younger players. What did you see from then and, and did any of them impress you in, in ways you maybe you weren't even expecting? Yeah, I think the, the young players, you know, I think we said after um, after Matlock and Ilkeston, you know, some of the younger players that have uh, been utilised in the squad uh, have, you know, have, have really done well. You know, they've come back. I think what they've, the, the, the opportunity that they've been given through pre-season to train every day, you know, particularly the young pros, to train every day with the first team, uh, you can see it's rubbed off from them. And then, you know, obviously some of the uh, some of the kids step up today from the under 18s. You know, there's four or five of the are under 18s today that have, have, have been given a chance as well with you know like with the uh, with the fringe squad. But within that, you know, you've got Richie Humphreys, you've got Christian Dennis, you've got uh, excuse me, Reese uh, Reese Mitchell. Um, you know, people like uh, Lawrence Maguire. Um, you know, so it's um, it's it's a good squad. And uh, you know, always pleasing to keep a clean sheet. You know, uh, I'll never lose that. Uh, you know, that defender's bit. You know, first and foremost, keep a clean sheet because if you can keep clean sheets, then uh, you know we, uh, we we can. You know, we, particularly with the forward players we've got, we feel as though we'll uh, we'll always create chances.